Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Stock and Perpetrator here. Today's video, we got some mail call. We'll start with this uh, small one first. It's a purchase I made to finish off an album. Let's see what we got. Right, let's get rid of this paperwork. Some of you already know by the envelope what this is. Make sure there's nothing else in there. Nope. Oh. Let me just get rid of that. This is the 76 silver uncirculated set. It's in a red envelope. And then you have this card. And this thing opens up. I'm taking it out of here because I am going to crack this out. I do save the packaging. I do save that. The reason I bought this is because I need the Ike Dollar to finish out our Dansko Bicentennial Coinage. Uh, don't know what album number this is. It's the, I don't know if they listed in the back. Oh, it's the 7096 Bicentennial Coinage. And this is the one I bought to uh, do just for fun. And then when my mom passed, I put some of some coins out of her collection in here <clears throat> and then a couple of Ike dollars she had in here and some other coins that I had already that I already had put away and the only one we needed was the 76 silver and they did not I think I showed y'all they did not put a section for the proof set I have one of those I should have brought it out for this but they didn't there's a three coin set in a little square box with the three coins in it you open the you flip the lid open I showed it in videos before but they didn't add a slot for those for the quarter the half dollar or the Ike for the proofs in the sil in the forty percent silver. So the album's technically not the complete set, but what we're gonna do is we only want the Ike. So I will leave the quarter and the half dollar still in their package. cut this carefully cut this Ike out <clears throat> before I take it out let me get this page open <clears throat> All right. wasn't thinking I should have done that ahead of time Slot open. We'll get this coin out. It's actually a pretty nice one. It's outverse. And the reverse. I was looking just to get this. Like but the cost of it, it was cheaper. It was cheaper just to get the to get the set and cut one out. And so there she is. We will fit him in his new permanent home. We will 
we will call this set officially complete. Like I said, I have the three coin proof set that I will put with this album. I'll find some way. I may just unfold it and lay it down behind the uh, my trust document there. And uh, so it will be with the, so it will be a true completed bicentennial set. But another set completed. And happy to have that. I said I'll leave these. I'll put these in my in my stack, but I'll leave these still sealed in the original cellophane. But they will go in the stack. So, anyways, let me know what you think. Have you done one of these bicentennial sets? Just uh, let me know down below, and we'll see you in another video.